The Adventures of Tom Swoon. Okay, my name is Tom Swoon. We just landed in Amsterdam. We're gonna have three days, four shows, and a special QA on this very special AD edition of Adventures of Tom Swoon. Let's go! Like the last one waiting outside to escape the bites. Don't wanna say goodbye. Love drunk, baby. Mm -hmm. I'll keep waiting all night for love to save me. Yeah, I'm so love drunk, baby. Last couple of years have been really amazing and intense for me. Only in 2016, I played exactly 100 shows all over the world. Now it's October 2017, and I really feel that this year I'm gonna play exact same amount of shows. Don't let me go. Not a lot of people know this, but before I started touring, I was riding a skateboard a lot for my life. And now, just to avoid injury, I prefer morning jogging and of course riding a bike. So we just arrived, Peter Zut in Amsterdam. First show, first location, straight from the f***ing airport. Let's do it, maximize labor night, let's go. Well, yes, truth to be told, my very first name as a DJ and producer was Pixel Cheese. In 2012, I signed up to Ultra Music under this name and released my very first single, Elva. Apart from that, I also released a couple of mashups, bootlegs and remixes for Garrett Emery and Nervo, still as Pixel Cheese. She woke up in the morning with the sunrise in her eyes. There's only one thing I really hate and I can't cope with it on a daily basis, and that is freezing cold and winter in general. And by the way, I don't really want to look like this guy. No more butterflies, cause they don't ever last. Stone. Well, this question was so creative, I just had to answer it. Well, the dream collab thing is pretty tempting, not gonna lie, but, well, you know, it's free sushi. For life! The answer is pretty clear. <laughs> Well, there are many records that have a special place in my heart, but if I had to pick one, that would be I Remember by Denmaus and Cascade, because this one actually got me into making my own music. And baby, I don't care. Well, I don't really have a much of time, mostly it's just going from the airport to the show, from the show to the airport, uh, but whenever I do, whenever I have some free time, I always try to make the best out of it. Go around the city, look for the best spots, the most beautiful sightseeing places, and um, take some photos as well, because I love taking photos myself. I mean, look outside, isn't it beautiful? There are mostly two elements of my pre-show routine which I try to follow everywhere I go. And first one is doing some last minute research and doing some last minute mashups before the show. And of course, the last one, but not least important, a disco nap. Okay, so that's the last night, last two shows in one place at the Butcher Social Club. We're going right now. I'm gonna first play my EDM set and my new track at the Young Gun stage, and then I'm gonna go to my own taped room to play a techno set.
I played many great shows and uh, well, if I think about it, there's one show, one gig, one party that really stood out for me and that was Unite with Tomorrowland in Dubai this year, which was totally off the f***ing hook. Thank you so much for that. Well, even though I'm a heavy sleeper and I love to sleep on the planes, somehow I still pick the aisle seat every time. Oh. 